Of all the damn restaurants in town, y'all just had to show your face in Merlots. I know you lied to Sam about being sick, sick of Stackhouse. What, you think I don't have time? Now I gotta work a double shift. I have kids, you know. Arlene, shut up. We're trying to have a conversation here. <sighs> I'll be back in a few minutes. Y'all better leave me a nice tip, cause I am not in a good mood today. You got it? Oh my god, Tara, it has been forever since we hung out just us girls. Man, I know, Sookie. When was the last time we got to do something like this? I don't know. It's hard doing that, you know, with me having a vampire boyfriend and all. Yeah, well at least you have a boyfriend. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing, just forget about it. Alright, I'm back. What'll it be? I'll take the pancakes and a couple of hash browns and a few pieces of bacon, please. Look, we stopped serving breakfast at 11. It is 11.04 and I have broken too many rules already. Well, I'm not that hungry. I just wanted some toast and eggs. Would that be alright? Sure. It's simple. What the hell? So I don't get my pancakes? Go check with Lafayette. Fine. You know what? I will. Yo, Lafayette. Shit, bitch. I am already starting to make lunch. I am not gonna make no motherfucking pancakes. Tara don't like it? She can go to another restaurant. Get out of my face! Tara, your cousin's already making lunch, so just order lunch. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a burger. And for you, Suke, how would you like your eggs? Hmm. I'll have my eggs Benedict, please. Alright, I'll get right on it. Oh my god, Suke Stackhouse! How could you do that to me? You know what eggs means to me and you just ordered eggs benedict. I don't understand. He can have some if he wants to. He's dead, Sookie. He's dead and you just ordered the only thing that reminds me of him. Should have had a V8. I didn't mean to upset you. I'm just hungry. Sookie Stackhouse, I cannot believe you're being so inconsiderate. First you ignore me for a dead man and then you are totally insensitive to the fact that my boyfriend was shot and killed. I don't want to see your face right now. Well, that was unfortunate. I certainly didn't mean to hurt her feelings or nothing. Lafayette said your eggs will be ready in a minute, and where is Tara? I don't know. I've learned not only to block people's thoughts, but spoken words as well. Well, whatever. I'm still expecting a big tip. <laughs>